Albemarle County is a beautiful place filled with winding country roads and scenic views. However, this beauty can also create blind curves and reduced visibility. While statistics prove that children are the most safe when riding on a school bus, statistics also show that the process of loading and unloading place children in the greatest risk. When the school bus is approaching your stop, the driver will activate their flashing amber lights. The driver will then come to a complete stop and open the door, which activates the stop sign, cross arm, and red flashing lights. The driver is in the best place to judge whether it is safe to board the bus and will signal the students to begin. While walking up the steps, it is important to hold the handrail to prevent slips and falls. Don't forget to say hi to your driver! Cross-loading the bus. Sometimes, students will need to cross the street in order to board the bus. This creates additional hazards. The driver will be extra cautious to check for other vehicles, so keep your eyes on the driver at all times. The driver will give a signal when it is safe to cross the road. It is very important to wait for your driver's hand signal. When you are signaled to cross, be sure to walk safely and do not run. Also, it is important to look both ways and check for oncoming traffic. If you are wearing headphones, you must remove both sides to allow you to hear instruction from your driver as well as oncoming traffic. While walking up the steps, it is important to hold the handrail to prevent slips and falls. Once on the bus, find your seats quickly so that the driver can continue their route. It is important that you sit in your seat properly by facing forward, holding your backpack on your lap, and keeping the aisle clear. On the bus, there are rules that need to be followed to ensure everyone's safety. Obey driver at all times. Be respectful and on time. Use the handrail. Wait for driver's signal with loading and unloading the bus. Keep hands to yourself and inside the bus. Face forward and keep the aisle clear. Walk to, from, and on the bus. No electronics while loading and unloading the bus. And finally, keep the bus clean. Unloading the bus. When the school bus is approaching your stop, the driver will activate the flashing amber lights. These lights are to warn other motorists that the bus is planning to stop. The driver will come to a complete stop and then open the door which activates the stop sign, cross arm, and red flashing lights. It is important to stay seated until the bus stops moving. The driver will let you know when it is safe to unload and remember always use the handrail. Cross unloading the bus. Sometimes students will need to cross the street in order to go home. This creates additional hazards. When the school bus is approaching your stop, the driver will activate the flashing amber lights. These lights are to warn other motorists that the bus is planning to stop. The driver will come to a complete stop and then open the door which activates the stop sign, cross arm, and red flashing lights. It is important to stay seated until the bus stops moving. The driver will let you know when it is safe to unload and remember always use the handrail. Once you are off of the bus, wait at the end of the cross arm, keeping your eyes on the driver at all times. The driver will be extra cautious to check for other vehicles and will give a signal when it is safe to cross the road. It is very important to wait for your driver's hand signal. 
When you are signaled to cross, be sure to walk safely and do not run. Also, it is important to look both ways and check for oncoming traffic. And finally, if you are wearing headphones, you must remove both sides to allow you to hear instruction from your driver as well as oncoming traffic. Music